Hey, what's up? Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Evolving Goddess. Welcome to my channel, y'all. So if you guys are new for the first time, welcome. If you have been rocking with me, though, you already know what it is. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. So what's up, Libra? This is your weekly guidance reading, okay? This is from July 11th to July 20th. What do y'all need to know right now? If you guys are going through some challenges, what's going on? I'm here to help you guys out. This is a level up spread, guys, okay? So how can we help you level up in your life? Whether that be personal development, a relationship, a job, a career, a business, guys, okay? So this is, you know, how can we help you live your best life, all right? These are general readings. Only take what resonates, y'all. Don't force it if it's not your story. All right, guys. So y'all, we got some good news coming in, right? Some dreams, maybe. You guys making some moves, okay? Um, so you guys, I feel like you guys are either coming out of a place, right, where there was worry, there was stress, there was anxiety, there was fear, all right? Focusing on worst case scenario. You guys are coming out of that. There's too much good news here, all right? Allowing worry to grow out of proportion here right not having peace of mind not having clarity okay maybe some confusion okay there was just fear all right but now all of a sudden we have falling in love this is the night of cups right this is you know maybe that proposal that love offer um this is that good news here it's like victory here i'm coming out on top here okay i have a wish like a wish of yours possibly or you guys are dreaming right you guys are just kind of you know in that romantic state okay so you guys are coming out of that right i know you guys are <laughs> All right, um, a new relationship, guys. Yeah, this is that good news that, you guys, this is beautiful. So this is the good news here. All right, this is the love offer, right? Maybe this is self-love, guys. Yeah, you guys are coming out of a place where you guys were just all stuck, you know, confused. Um, and you guys, good news for my, ha my family, my emotional fulfillment here. A wish of mine is coming true here. All right, raising my children, my family were good. Right? I'm surrounding myself around people that I can trust here. Yeah, guys. All right. Um, you guys, and this even could be about business, right? Queen of Pentacles. This is a motherly figure. All right. She's sitting pretty. Her eyes are closed. She's calm. She's cool. Like, it's like the diamond here. Guys, this diamond. This diamond. Yeah, maybe some of you guys are getting proposals or you guys are kind of going forward with some proposals here. Um, but this is somebody who turned her pain into power here because she's kind of been through some changes, right? Rebuilding on something solid here. All right, old belief systems were shut down. Old people that weren't resonating are gone. All right, important life changes. Maybe people kind of realize their value, realize their worth here. Maybe starting businesses. This is maybe some money coming in, some good news coming in regarding money, um, guys. But this is being smart, making smart choices, right? So for my people that are out there, right, that are starting businesses here, okay, really kind of being practical in your decisions. All right, staying grounded, being making decisions from a peaceful state of mind here. All right, yeah, guys, we got balance. All right, something that you guys are maybe kind of waiting for, putting in the work for it. All right, guys, this is also reciprocity. This could be money coming in for you guys, right? Um, so for me, guys, I feel like you want to make sure you're surrounding yourself around like-minded people. Make sure that that energy is in the thoughts that you want it to focus on, right? Not the fears, okay, guys? Right, walking away from something, right? Walking away from a place where you weren't satisfied, stepping into the unknown, but you're walking towards your wish fulfillment here, right? Yeah, some kind of new opportunity, guys. All right. So you guys are maybe kind of waiting on something with this seven, these two together, or seven. We saw the seven of pentacles here. Or you guys are putting in the work for something. You guys are building something, creating something, some kind of good news. Maybe a new business here, right? Maybe traveling, a new home. All right, guys. Yeah. All right. Let's see. This is beautiful energy, y'all. All right, so let's find out what's going on with you guys. Death card, Scorpio energy, letting something in. All right, maybe it's something within yourself, right? Um, or somebody, a job, right? You're leaving one job, going to another job here. All right, so let's see. Let's see, Libra. What's the challenge for you guys, okay? What's the challenge? What's the strength you guys want to What's the strength you guys want to use? What's the weakness you guys want to watch out for? Um, and what's the advice for you guys? Be strong, be courageous, okay? Stand up for what you guys believe in. All right, rising above adversities here. Moving, maybe traveling, relocating here, just mentally being in a better place and moving forward, right? No longer being stuck, needing to kind of make a decision, taking your eye, you know, removing a blindfold from your eyes and just really not sitting on something, okay? Um, um, getting that clarity and then getting that clarity moving forward here all right standing up for your stand fighting for the things that you want being courageous here going for it right being gentle being compassionate whether this be people kind of working together here um yeah this could be a whole relationship guys otherwise this is definitely you know 
you guys making sure that you are emotionally balanced, emotionally mature here. This could be somebody kind of coming, bringing you that love, right? You're sitting really pretty. You're attractive. You're confident here. You're going after the things that you want. You have that creative tip, that creative, those creative juices, all right? Otherwise, guys, this is definitely saying, you know what? Be in a place where you're emotionally balanced so that you can get that creativity, right? Then you can kind of take action on something, all right, guys? Be still. Be still, guys, all right? Building on something solid, guys, that commitment, putting in the work for the life that you want to have, okay? People kind of retreating from the rest of the world or you're retreating from the rest of the world. Ten of Pentacles, I am putting in the work for the long term here, all right? Once again, possibly money coming in for you guys. Otherwise, um, this is definitely you guys working, setting a solid foundation for something, okay? For the long term, guys, you guys got so much money. <laughs> all right, y'all, let's see what's going on, Libra. All right. Your happiness, Leo card. Guys, some good news coming in for sure. All right. Otherwise, you guys are self-love, right? I'm focusing on my happiness here. Um, This could be some, have something to do with children. All right, guys. But it's like definitely kind of meditating, taking a break, taking a step back, okay? Healing from something, right? Maybe focusing on yourself or after some kind of break, you're getting that good news, right? Your happiness here, right? People are being vulnerable. They're opening up here, going after the better days, being enlightened, dropping that wall, guys. All right. Let's see. Maybe this has something to do with your children. All right, guys. King of Cups. This is beautiful. The king and the queen. All right. So once again, you guys, love offers. People may be kind of entering into your life or people are just, this is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Um, this is people, somebody being emotionally mature, right? I have a dream here, um, but not only am I having the dream, I'm being practical and I'm taking action. The kings are all about action. I'm moving forward here. All right, guys, don't just be uh, moving forward with worry and fear, but I feel like you guys are kind of coming out of that. You guys are kind of going after something that means a lot to you, right? Emotionally, you guys are maturing here, evolving, right? Leveling up. All right, guys, so what's the challenge for you guys? The Six of Cups, all right? So once again, yeah, it could be your children, guys, right? Um, because children is coming through really strong. So it could be your children. It could be, you know, the past experiences, right? It could be a soulmate connection here. Um, yeah, it could just be like being stuck in the past here, okay? Not acting on something, guys, all right? Something maybe from your childhood, okay? Something from your childhood, all right, guys? Turning your back on that experiences or turning your back on your childhood, right? Leveling up and being mature, right? And getting that, those emotions in balance here, okay? Because we go from the Six of Cups, right? From children to a whole king here, okay, guys? All right, this could be somebody you even have children with here, possibly, okay? All right. All right, so, um, okay, so something about some emotions, right? This King of Cups has his back against the children, right? So somebody, you know, it could be a challenge where somebody's not getting that emotional support for from somebody when it comes to their children, right? Like your child may not be getting emotional support, basically, okay? All right, guys. All right, so what's the strength that you guys want to use here? All right, guys, you want to find the beauty in everything. That's kind of tough, though, right? I know, I get that. Um, the Knight of Pentacles, okay? This is finding beauty in the journey. All right, because if we're working, if we're stressing and worrying on the things that, you know, are just kind of having us like, oh, well, this is going to happen and this will never happen, guys, that's going to continue to grow. So we want to try to see how we can kind of turn the pain into power, right, in this particular situation. All right, we want to be practical. We want to be committed. We want to slow things down, guys, okay? The Knight of Pentacles is somebody who kind of puts in the work, right? He's committed for the long term. He doesn't give up. All right, this may be kind of seeking out help from an individual like this here. Um, but guys, I feel like this is just kind of really being practical, right? Slowing things down, not getting in your emotions here, and then kind of making fast decisions, guys, okay? So being practical, putting in the work for something, guys, okay? Leaving the past in the past, but doing it slowly, right? Finessing it, okay? All right, so what's the weakness you guys want to watch out for? Ooh, guys, the devil card, a whole Capricorn, possibly, guys. All right, so you want to make, you want to watch out for either one, relationships that are emotionally unavailable here. All right, you want to watch out for people that are maybe kind of like telling you something and not really following through here. Um, you want to make sure that your emotions are in, in a balanced state of mind. All right, you want to go ahead and eliminate people, places, or things, right, where they're, you know, they're toxic, right? This person is emotionally just all over the place when it's with the devil, okay? Avoiding situations like that, okay? Maybe ad attachments, addictions, guys. We got this big old, you know, this big old cup here. It could be, you know, alcohol, things like that. Um, 
Self-doubt, guys. Self-doubt, fear, worry, right? Feeling powerless here. Feeling like you can't do anything, right? Not having control of your emotions, all right? Losing your fire, losing your inspiration, right? Losing your spark here, okay? Like losing the dream, like giving up on the dream. You want to be careful of that? What else with this devil card? Allowing something to kind of level you up here, guys. Yeah, staying focused, guys. Staying focused on the dream, right? Because the Knight of Pentacles, you know, that's a slow moving night, right? Things could be at a standstill here. They're moving too slow. I'm getting scared. I have this passion in mind, you know, and it's not it's not moving fast enough for me. Okay, that's like the story I'm seeing here, right, on my cards. I know it's different, but I see the story, right? They they paint stories as we do it this way, guys. Okay, so guys, some of you guys are things are at a standstill, right? They're not moving fast enough for you guys. Are getting a little bit scared, like where is it? At? What is it? You know, you guys, just kind of tempering out those emotions, tempering out those balance. Okay, still step into your power right knowing that slow and steady is going to run the race because you're building an empire okay um or even if this is something from with regarding your children right trying to reconcile something with somebody you have children with possibly guys slow and steady right everything is going to be a quick fix okay guys so uh, what's the advice for you guys so for me i feel like you know taking a break right allowing the healing to kind of take place right Learning from this experience here, being enlightened, growing, growing from this, yeah, growing, guys, okay? This is definitely growing here. Turning your pain into power, guys. Turning your pain into power with that three of, that three of swords, guys, yeah, okay? All right, so, um, okay, so the three stories. So we talk about learning, right? Learning here, okay? So for some of you guys, this is definitely about kind of continuously putting in the work, right? Whatever wasn't working for you before, it's okay. I learned from this. Now I know what I need to do differently. I'm not going to give up just because it didn't work. I'm going to stay committed. I'm just going to take my time. I'm going to do something differently here. Others of you guys, this is definitely be like analyzing your life right now, right? I learned something. I had some heartbreak. I had some sadness, okay? I had some disappointment. It leveled me up here. I want to do something differently here, okay? I'm going to rearrange my life okay that way i can get the harvest right because the seven of pentacles was the next card on it okay so you guys that's all i have for you guys all right so um you guys if this is resonating with you guys please join me on vimeo right we'll go a little bit deeper we'll talk about your blockage your blockage <laughs> Your block it is what do you guys need to surrender um all right what's in there possible future for you guys and then also um you know the action steps guys what action steps do you guys need to take so that you can kind of move forward here okay so i love you guys if you want to book a personal reading please hop over to my website evolvinggoddessprofor.com i love y'all as I always talk to you girl i'll talk back y'all peace